Hughes and Pelham are now dealing with power distribution problems this evening. Our first alert weather forecaster, Anthony Bordenero, joins us live from Pelham. And it seems like Anthony and, oh, Anthony, there you are. Thank you so much for joining us in Mitchell County. Uh, just tell us a little bit what the weather has been looking like. I can see some type of activity going on behind you. What is going on over there in Pelham? Yeah, as you can see behind me, power crews are still working on it. I'm told that around 64 people are without power this evening. And I'm wearing a raincoat. There's still some light rain out in the area. And these uh, power workers are still braving a little bit of that rain. So let me get behind the camera and let me show you currently uh, what's going on. And let me show you the, the tree that fell that caused the... Uh, um, so I want to be... It seems that we do have some connection issues with Anthony, but as you can see, there is a crew working to get that power restored, and even in the rain that continues to fall, we're being told that power will be restored shortly, and the area was never warning it was in the severe thunderstorm warning that means winds could have been excessive of over 60 miles per hour when we have first alert weather days we never know exactly what's going to happen but the threat for strong storms is there anthony was able to find out more information about some downed trees and we'll get back to anthony with the information that he has live in pelham thank you so much anthony for braving the storm and going out there to give our viewers that coverage